check that out. You see the steam? What does that mean? That means we're about to get some crappie in the boat. A lot of crappie about to go in the boat. It's fall, baby. It don't get much better than this. That steam rising, that 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 lake is taking a huge breath right now, and it's cooling. I'll tell you what. What that means is we're gonna have a lot of fish in the boat. We're gonna have fun today. I did some interesting changes to my uh, live scope system, so I'm gonna walk you through those today. I am gonna show you some active captain as always. So sit back, re relax, enjoy. Please do me a favor, subscribe, share the content. Uh, you know, this is the growing season in terms of YouTube, so I really would appreciate the support and sharing the content and getting some uh, new subscribers. We want to grow this thing, so, but check that out. It don't get much better than that, folks. Can you see that steam? Can you see that, that big breath that lake is taking right now? Crappy going in the boat. Thanks for watching, guys. Here we go. This is going to be fun. Thanks for watching 3 Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies. Well, you know things have to change, folks, and so I do some tweaking with my live scope in the last couple of weeks, and I gotta tell you, my boat is on fire right now. It is, it's tuned up, it feels good. You know that feel, feeling that you get when you have your live scope and you just know it's looking good? Well, right now it is, and folks, I can't wait to share what I've done to it, but at the same time, you know, it's fall fishing, and we're gonna put some fish in the boat, and that by itself is super exciting. Ooh. Probably the number one thing that I've changed about my live scope system is both the transducer and the black box are brand new. And when I did that and I did an update, I started messing around with the color palettes. So instead of that emerald, the black emerald, the green, I've actually changed to the amber, back to the amber. And let me tell you folks, it pops. I mean, it really pops. I mean, I'm just gonna tell you right now, it's an incredible palette right now compared to what it was. It used to be, I didn't feel like it, it had the, the substance like the black emerald does, but now I'm really enjoying it. So I'll show you some clips here of the, of, the, of the new amber. In fact, I did a video about a week ago um, when I went through my entire live scope system and I showed it there. And let me tell you, that was the day that I said, I'm going back. So I've gone back to the amber. Do me a favor, comment below. Let me know what colors you guys are using. Um, Cause I'm always up for change and always up for suggestions. And that's how that black emerald came around and I used it for gosh dang, probably about two years. But I'm back to the amber right now and we'll see. Now, why did I get a new black box and a new transducer? I always felt like I had a halo around my base, a halo around the bottom. I didn't feel like I was seeing the detail that I had seen back in the day. And let me tell you, my detail's back and I'm enjoying it. I did that whole video on the live scope. I'll link that uh, video here above. So check it out because it's an incredible informative video that, you know, less about music and subs, uh, in terms of quality, but the, but the information is incredible with two live scope systems giving you guys some feedback. Let's put some fish in the boat. That's what we're here for. Too much jibber jabber. There's our first good fish right there. That's a great fish. Good start to the day. <laughs> Right there, good fish. Mm, mm, mm. We let him go. Mm. Just not the size we're looking for right there. Kind of moving around the lake, trying different things out. Good either nonetheless. Right now we're fishing about 16 foot deep, which is really deep. Um, not what I would have planned to do today. camera right there 
another salad eater right there so today i'm fishing with the ghost you know i do the bait the bait shop uh, after guide trips it's available at those after a guide trip with three pound fishing you can check that out three pound fishing at gmail.com if you have an interest just message me but that's the ghost it's a white milky with a silver flake and then of course three pound fishing jig heads are second to none um bait keeper on the back a hook that will bend it will not break and uh quality all around that eyelet is incredibly important especially when you're dealing with these micro braids and this is the sniping braid the four strand optimal which i think is awesome casting everybody that touches it loves it from a casting perspective it's a uh, extremely light i supplement that with a uh, number seven split shot makes it easier for me to pick up on live sonar and gets it down there faster and then of course ozark rods i'm fishing with one of my classics the gray from ozark rod but the three pound fishing elite series the maroon ones are my absolute favorite but what soft bites man it's crazy on this particular pile and that's a really good fish but this pile these fish are not even moving but just the most subtle we let them go subtle bite you know i just switched up baits to like a pepper a pepper black pepper with uh monkey milk oh this is a good fish feels like a good fish oh you gotta love it folks the fall bite is an aggressive bite i actually think it's a bite in which you don't have to get up early for i think the bite is uh even when the sun comes up i think that that bite is super good um you know I, even the guide trips we get started just a little bit later during the fall time because i do think that when that sun comes up that kind of triggers them a little bit um, at least that's my thought and that's my own you know my own experience but um if you guys are interested in the guide trips um, still have a lot of availability in the months of november and december and uh love to have you um, we are crushing it on uh all lakes really just depends what kind of experience you want so um uh, Ren lake and uh my home lake the lake of egypt is where we would choose from based on the experience that you want to have and so i'm still casting out here at 30 feet and uh i mean i'm just telling you it's just been fun i haven't showed you guys a, a half of the catches that i've had um just trying to locate some really good starting spots for the guide trip that's coming up next is basically what i'm trying to do oh and i just flat out missed that one but this is what we do i could take two to three people you know one thing that i have been doing a lot differently lately is using a lot of scents and uh, little pace little things to try to trigger the bite um, although i will always say that i think that profile is probably number one and i think vibrations number two i think number three is the ability to if you can take in that other part of that process which is a scent and that's a good thing so i've been using that a little bit lately the amber color is a big, a big chain. That is the goal of three pound fishing. We gonna stay on it. We gonna, we gonna, we gonna give it all we got. So more to come on that. But I do appreciate you guys watching and uh, stay tuned. I have a lot of announcements coming up here in the next two weeks. Legit announcements that are gonna be fun and exciting and new stuff that's out there. So have a good one, guys. Peace out. Thanks for watching 3 Pound Fishing, partnered up with these fantastic companies.